Located halfway between Singapore and Kuala Lumpur is the town of Muar in the southern state of Johor. If the roads are clear, it should only take you around 2 to 3 hours to get there from either Kuala Lumpur or Singapore. Today, my friend who was born and raised in Muar is going to take me to her hometown and show me around. If you're planning to stay the night, there are several hotels to choose from. We are staying in Muarar 99 Hotel close to the city center. It's nothing fancy, but it's clean and has everything that we need. Plus, it provides free parking. Once we are done checking in, we go out to explore the place. And just like most other cities in Malaysia, Muar also has its own street arts. When you're tired of all the walking, get yourself a glass of iced pear juice. It's the perfect choice especially on a hot sunny day. For dinner, we are going to Muar Soup House located right next to the Hindu temple. They have a variety of soups, but their specialty is the gearbox soup, which is made of a cow's or goat's knee joints. You can suck on the bone marrow using a straw. We are pairing it with rojak paru, which is basically a dish consisting of fried tofu, cucumber, lettuce, cow lung, and topped with a sweet and spicy sauce. My friend also introduces me to her favorite childhood snack called mi siput. It's not a type of noodle as the name suggests but it's more of a crunchy snack to be eaten with sambal. Muar is also famous for oyster omelette, and ota ota, which can either buy fresh and have them grilled for you on the spot, or you can buy them frozen if you like to take them home. If you can eat non-halal, you can also try a noodle dish called meepo. Our next stop is Kopi 434 Cafe, which is a local coffee brand. Here you can learn more about the company history and also buy some coffee as a souvenir. If you have time on weekends or in the evening, you could go on a cruise along the river. It wasn't operational during my visit unfortunately. And of course, if you go to Moar, don't leave without trying the food that this town is most famous for. Asam Pedas and Mi Bandung Muar. I will include the list of food to try in the description below. 
And that marks the end of my stay in Moar, as we are now heading to our next destination in Johor. Want to find out where it is? Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so that you won't miss on any of my future posts. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment and share and I'll see you in the next video.